Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, peace from above and from the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. state of the holy churches of God, and for the unity of the faithful, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for this holy house, and for those who enter with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our Metropolitan Keycon, our Archbishop Paul, the Honorable Priest of the Diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and the whole people of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for this God, dependent land, as president, all civil authorities, and for the armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for these cities, for every city and country place, and for the faithful dwelling in them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord seasonable weather and abundance of the fruits of the earth and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for travelers by land, by sea, and by air, the sick, the suffering, for captives and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our deliverance from all affliction, anger, danger, and need, let us pray to the Lord. Lord Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O oh God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, and if all us and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another, and all our life unto Christ our God. Grant to thee our new all glory, honor, and worship, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praises to thy name, most high. Through the prayers of the Theotokos, O Savior, save us. To declare thy steadfast love in the morning, and thy faith. Through the prayers of the Theotokos, O Savior, save us, to show that the Lord is upright, and there is no unrighteousness in Him. Through the prayers of the Theotokos, O Savior, save us, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto Again, yet again, in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. Thine is the majesty, and thine are the kingdom, the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. The Lord is King, he is robed in majesty. The Lord is robed, he is good in restraint. Through the prayers of the saints, O Savior, save us. Yea, the world is established. Thy decrees are very sure, holiness befits thy house, O Lord, forevermore. Through the prayers of the saints, O Savior, save us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and ever.
Christ our God, traveling down death by death, who art born of the Holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit, Savior. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us. Keep us, O God, by thy grace. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, ever Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. Thou art a good God, the lover of mankind, and we glorify thee. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Oh, come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the Lord of our salvation. O oh, Son of God, who art wonderful in thy saints, save us who sing to thee. Let us come into his presence with thanksgiving. Let us make a joyful noise to him with songs of praise. O Son of God, who art wonderful in thy saints, save us who sing to thee. Alleluia. For the Lord our God is a great God, a great King above all gods. O Son of God, who art wonderful in thy saints, save us who sing Hands of the depths of the earth, the heights of the mountains are his own. O Son of God, who art wonderful in thy saints, save us who sing to thee. Alleluia. The sea is his, for he made it, and his hands from the dry land. O Son of God, who art wonderful in thy saints, save us who sing to thee.
Master, we saw someone casting out demons in your name, and we tried to stop him because he does not follow with us. Jesus said to him, Do not forbid him, for he is not against us, for whoever is not against us is for us. It came to pass when the days were near for him to be taken up, that he resolutely set his face to go to Jerusalem, and he sent messengers ahead of him. They went and entered into a village of the Samaritans in order to make preparation for him, but the people did not receive him because he was heading for Jerusalem. When his disciples James and John saw this, they said, Lord, do you want us to command fire to come down from heaven and destroy them just as Elias did? But Jesus turned around and rebuked them, and they went on to another village. Again, we 
pray for those who bear fruit and do good works in this holy and all venerable house, for those who serve and those who sing, for all the people here present who wait thy great and rich mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. For thou art a merciful God, the lover of mankind, and we glorify thee, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages.
May the Lord God remember me his kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. The newly departed Metropolitan Theodosius, and all those who lie at rest in our cemetery, loved ones, founders, benefactors, may the Lord God remember in his kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. And you and all Orthodox Christians, may the Lord God remember you in his kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Let us complete our prayer unto the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the precious gifts now offered, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy house and for those who enter with faith, reverence, and fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. That we may be delivered from all affliction, anger, danger, and need. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord mercy. Help us, save us, and mercy on us, and keep us, O oh God, by thy grace. Lord mercy. That the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us ask of the Lord. Grant it, o Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies. Let us ask of the Lord. Pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. Grant it, o Lord. All things that are good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. Grant it, o Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. A Christian ending to our life painless, blameless, and peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask. Granted, o Lord. To commemorate in our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. of thine only begotten Son, with whom thou art blessed, together with thy now holy, but in life-giving Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Not me. 
shall come again with glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and the Son together is worshipped and glorified and spoke by the prophets, in one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I acknowledge your baptism for the remission. Seraphim, six winged, many eyed, throw off born on their wings, singing the triumphant hymn, shouting, proclaiming, and saying, Offer unto thee on 
behalf of all and for all.
Those who remember the poor upon us all send down thy mercies. And remember especially, O Lord, thy servants, and Michael, Linda, Michael, Rita, Peter, Lorraine, Philip, Nancy, Adele, Rachel, Jacob, Carol, Archpriest Vladimir, Virginia, Archpriest Eugene, Kathleen, Julie, Betty, Jane, Robert, Dimitri, Natalia, Lisa, Mary, Peter, Dorothy, Nicholas, Elizabeth, Christopher, Thomas, Janice, Philip, Mark, Joshua, Alec, George, George, Nancy, Fatima, Chrysostom, Judy, Luke, Christina, Juliana, Peggy, Elizabeth, Phil, Kathleen, Maya, Alexander, Anna, Victoria, Archbishop David, William, Carol, Alexander, Andrew, Jillian, and Andrew, the child you're born to them, Julia, and Justin, and Amelia, and Ryan, Christine, and Joe, Irene, and Luke, and Jane, and Christos, and Lisa, and Josh, Ashley and Joseph, the children to be born to them, the newly illumined child, Michael, victims of violence, disease, disaster here and throughout the world, and those who help and serve them, and all those whom we have in mind at this time, and grant that with one mouth and with one heart we may glorify and praise thine unhonorable and majestic name, of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, be with all of you. And with your spirit. Having remembered all the saints again, yet again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the precious gifts now offered and sanctified, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. That our God, who loves mankind, receiving them upon his holy, heavenly, and awaited altar, for an odor of sweet spiritual fragrance, will send down upon us in return his divine grace and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Lord, mercy. That we may be delivered from all affliction, anger, danger, and need. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, mercy. That the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us ask of the Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, and guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord. Pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. All things that are good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. A Christian ending to our life, painless, blameless, and peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask. Having asked for the unity of the faith and the communion of the Holy Spirit, let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. So 
Thyself, O Master, make smooth what lies ahead. According to the individual need of each, sail with those who travel with those who travel by land and by air. Heal the sin, O God, who art the physician of our souls. Through the grace and compassion and love toward mankind of thine only begotten Son, with whom thou art blessed, together with thine all holy, good, and life giving Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of angels. I believe, O Lord, and I confess that Thou art truly the Christ, the Son of the living God, who camest into the world to save sinners, of whom I am first. I believe also that this is truly Thy own most blessed blood, that this is truly Thy own precious blood. Therefore I pray Thee, have mercy upon me, and forgive my transgressions, both voluntary and involuntary, of word and of deed, committed in knowledge or in ignorance. May be worthy to partake without condemnation of thy most pure mysteries for the remission of my sins and unto life everlasting. Amen. Of thy mystical supper, O Son of God, accept me today as a communicant, for I will not speak of thy mystery to thine enemies. Neither like Judas will I give thee a kiss. Like the thief will I confess thee. Remember me, O Lord, in thy kingdom. May the communion of thy holy mysteries, neither to my judgment nor to my condemnation, O Lord, but to the healing of your soul.
them he has set a tent for the sun, which comes forth like a bridegroom leaving his chamber. <laughs>
touched your lips, it shall pardon your transgressions, it shall heal your infirmities. Having beheld the resurrection of Christ, let us worthily worship the Holy Lord Jesus, the only sinless one. Radiant, O most pure Theotokos, in the resurrection of thy Son, O Christ, great and most holy Pascha, O wisdom, word, and power of God, grant that we may more perfectly partake of thee in the never fading day of thy kingdom. And wash away, O Lord, the sins of all those remembered here by thy precious blood, the prayers of us attend, having partaken of the divine, holy, most pure, heavenly, immortal, awesome, and life-giving mysteries of Christ, let us worthily give thanks unto the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us. Keep us, O God, by thy grace, asking that the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless. Let us commend ourselves and one another in all our life unto Christ our God. Thank thee, O Master, who lovest mankind, benefactor of our souls. Thou hast made us worthy this day of thy heavenly and immortal mysteries. Make straight our path, strengthen us all in thy fear, guard our life, make firm our steps through the prayers and intercessions of the glorious Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, and of all thy saints. For thou art our sanctification, and we glorify thee, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of angels. Let us depart in peace. In the name of the Lord. Let us pray to the Lord. O Lord, who blessest those who bless thee and sanctifiest those who trust in thee, save thy people and bless thine inheritance. Preserve the fullness of thy church. Sanctify those who love the beauty of thy house. Glorify them in return by thy divine power. And forsake us not who put our hope in thee. Give peace to thy world, to thy churches, to thy priests, to all those in civil authority, and to all thy people. For all good giving and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from thee, the Father of lights. And unto thee do we send up glory, thanksgiving, and worship. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Blessing of the Lord be upon you through his grace and love for mankind always. 
now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, O Christ, our God, and our sure hope. Glory to thee. Christ, our true God, through the prayers of his all pure and blameless mother, the supplication of the holy, glorious, and all audible apostles of our Father among the saints, Nicholas, Archbishop of Myra and Lycia, the wonder worker, of our holy fathers and mothers among the saints, whom we commemorate on this day, and especially the holy, equal to the apostles of Ergus, Bishop and wonder worker of Hierapolis, of the seven sleepers of Ephesus, Maximilian, Iamblichus, Martinian, John Dionysius, ex-custodian and Antonius, of John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints made that same Lord, have mercy upon us and save us, for he alone is good, and the lover of mankind. Amen. Is begotten to the most blessed moments we'll be serving a parasis for Metropolitan Theodosius, long the primate of the Orthodox Church in America who reposed uh, on the 19th. Uh, the funeral service is taking place today. Uh, may God bless and keep you. Oh, well, yeah, actually it's appropriate. The, the service announcement um, I do make every year. Of course, every year I say, if you're sick, please don't come to church. Well, there's nothing, nothing, <laughs> nothing new about that this year. Uh, you know, if you're, if you're sick, please don't come to church. If you're unwell, please don't come to church. We would happily come to see you. Just let us know and we can arrange uh, a pastoral visit or whatever. But it's also time to think about how you walk on the streets with the ice. Um, it's, it can be surprisingly slippery. And it, as, I mean, it, you know how it goes. You fall, you break your hip, you go to the hospital, you get COVID, I mean, you get pneumonia, and, and there you are. The next time we see you, it's at the cemetery. So it's, it's really bad to fall. It's really awful to fall. It's just a misery. So please walk like a penguin or put creepers on, do something, but be very, very careful and for the next six months, I guess, <laughs> here in Minnesota. Glory to thee, O God, glory to thee, O God, glory to thee, O God.
Cleanse my soul and saint, by my reason, it's made firm my knees and body, and my five senses. Now be to the fear of yours, correct God, and keep me from soul destroying words and deeds. Cleanse me, purify me, do not keep me understanding and illumination. Manifest me to be a temple of life and spirit and all the home of many sins. May every evil thing, every form of passion, flee from its own life. As I become the tabernacle of the community, I offer these intercessors all the saints, filling this body of souls. Thy full run to wise apostles and thy pure and gracious mother. Accept their prayers and their love and respect, and make me thy servant of God. So thou art the only sanctification and life for our souls of goodness. And to thee, O Master and God, we ascribe the Lord day by day. O Lord the Jesus Christ, our God, let thy holy body be my eternal life, thy precious blood, my remission of sins. Let this Eucharist be my joy, health, and gladness. Make me a sinner worthy to stand on the right hand of thy glory when all since I can come. Through the prayers of the most pure mother and of all the saints. O most holy lady, therefore, it is the light of my heart and soul. My hope, my perfection, my refuge, my rest, and my joy. I thank you for your permitted me to be worthy to be a partaker of the most pure body and precious blood of your Son. Give the light of understanding to the eyes of my heart. You that gave birth to the true life, in line with you who endeavored to buy sin, you that gave birth to the fountain, the fountain of immortality, have mercy on your loving brother, the merciful God, wrath with the function and contrition of God, humility in my thoughts and release from the slavery of my delusion, and that even me, even to my last breath, to receive the sanctification of the most pure mysteries, for the healing of so many love, grant me tears of repentance and confession that may glorify your ways of my life, for your blessing and great be glorified forever. Lord, now that thou thy servant of ours will be supported by word from my eyes have seen the salvation which thou hast prepared before the face of all people. A light to the mighty that has passed into the glory of thy people, is our heaven. Holy God, who the mighty and immortal and mercy on us, holy God, who the mighty and immortal and mercy on us, holy God, who the mighty and immortal and mercy on us, glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages of earth. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, cleanse us from our sins and ask for God our transgressions. Holy One, visit and do our infirmities for many in sake. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages of all. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth, and sins in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine are the kingdom, the power, and the glory, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. from your lips like a beacon is enlightened in the universe and shown to the world riches of poverty and has revealed to us the heights of humility, teaching us by your words of Father Michael's lost and intercede to the Lord Christ our God to save our soul. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Having received divine grace from heaven in your mouth, you teach all men to worship one God in Trinity. O all blessed and venerable John Chrysostom, we worthily praise you, for you are a teacher of revealing things divine. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages, Amen. Steadfast protectress of Christians, constant advocate before the Creator, do not despise the crowd of sinners, but in your goodness come speedily to help us to call on you in faith. Hasten to hear our petition and to intercede for us, if they have us, for you always protect those who honor you. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, Amen. More on the world, which ever be known to the glory, is filled with heaven and seraph, without the common to give us without the Lord, and the Lord of we magnify you. In the name of the Lord, Master of Lovers. May Christ work through God to the prayers of the Lord, pure and blameless Mother of God, and the mercy of all us will save us. He will always do it for us. Amen. 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 Amen.
generation to generation. Thank you. 
mercy on us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, cleanse us from our sins, O Master, pardon our transgressions, O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And it is is not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, thine are the kingdom, the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages. Establish the souls of the 
the servants, the Metropolitan Theodosius and Sandra, who have been taken from us in the mansions of the righteous, give them rest in Abraham's bosom and comfort them upon the just. And have mercy upon us, for he alone is good. Have the lover of 